Ooh. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. Carrie, Carrie Fisher's yeah. hotness in Blues she Brothers is was underrated. Something else in that movie. Yeah, because she was like a, like she a was badass. A dirty girl. Wow. <laughs> you dirty girl. <laughs> All right. Here we go. There it is. Yeah. Check the mic and make sure it sounds right, boys. Oh, yeah. Welcome back <laughs> to the Gentleman's Den. <laughs> Jeff, Kayla, Sean, and we have a guest, our first guest in the new studio. The man, the myth, the legend. I watched him tackle a bear once <laughs> and juggle his like a kitten caboodle. Holy shit. <laughs> he, he, <laughs> it's Billy Badass. <laughs> Billy <laughs> Badass, a.k.a. the... Nerdy beer guy. Nerdy beer guy, a.k.a. So the director of Blame, a.k.a. Wait, who are you? B.J. <laughs> Raniac. Welcome. Hello. Welcome back, buddy. Hey, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, I'm empty. How <laughs> dare you? What's, what do you mean? What are so, you double fair? Thing? We don't ask so, questions about this. It's, uh, it's water. A little caveat to start this is uh, we uh, just oh filmed a hour's worth of beer reviews with <laughs> BJ, so we're starting this thing tuned up. Oh, a little bit. Ready to go. We got the action. Yeah. Kayla was a big fan of Dude, all the beers. All the beers. Say, My favorite thing ever. All the beers. Yep, I am great. proud of you. Greatest. I am proud of you. The, oh. oh they are them. not proud. I love them. <laughs> they did sound like they were purring. Mm-hmm. Mm, I purr. Wow. <laughs> that not is happy a new that noise. This podcast has is, started. Is that a lion? <laughs> it might be a tiger. There's two gargoyles up there. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Oh, they are very angry. Wow. So angry. <laughs> uh, New pets, you know. And here we are. God damn it, it's like a jungle. The, uh, I love it. Welcome to the Weissmuller Pad. Whether there's fucking cats on top of the table or dogs growling from on top Welcome of the stairs. Welcome to our zoo. It is a jungle and it's pretty delightful, honestly. <laughs> Wow. Like what the I just hell want to is go it? Wrestle them. They I normally wanted... don't do that. They at least shut the fuck up normally. <laughs> yeah, oh, there they go. And then they, you just heard them walk away. Yeah, they and they're gone. That was it. Okay. They just need a mama to say it. They said, it's "Shut the fuck like, up." Mama said, "Shut the fuck up." Let's it's go. It's kind of like pit zoomies, <laughs> and then they're good. Oh, yep. here comes Chewy. Oh, Chewy's gonna make he's his coming in. Oh, oh, man. Man. I actually love this cat so much. That's fine. You can love him. That's fine. Here we go. Here it oh. comes. Three, two, one. And, uh, <laughs> it's, either, it's either the I'm camera's gonna get knocked on or, or oh. it's gonna come up the fucking stairs. I feel like Mama's just staring at him. Like, what you gonna do? She. Oh, <laughs> wait. Something took. And that's they're me, off. Buddy. Oh, that's you. What was your favorite? Oh no! Out of the wait, beer no, review. that's out of the beer. My favorite out of all the beer. Mm. The marshmallow. That was my uh, favorite. Uh, no, I feel like uh, the very first one, the, the punch fr- one, the fruit punch. Yes. Oh, the yep, the seltzer. It's a uh, uh, Eagle Park. Yeah, yes. so that yeah. was probably my favorite, and then the very last, second last, yeah, last, the, whatever the, it was, the, second to last. The, the, uh, Which was the marshmallow? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. Yep. Those were that my favorite. Best. Those were good. Um, those were good. Actually. There were the two that taste it like. Uh, I'll correct myself. I say dirt weed, ditch weed. <laughs> Did we? I've never heard the term <laughs> dirt weed. weed. It it honestly uh, it did taste like the brick from back of the day. <laughs> a little bit when you had to split it up. Break and get off. There's break. no color. Break. Everything's dry as shit. Yeah, like what are you just crumbling about, apart. And you and you cough like you've never <laughs> coughed before because yep. you've just <laughs> inhaled straight razor it blades. It pretty much just tasted like bad decisions. Yeah, Ooh. yeah. <laughs> but that's what you know what. <laughs> Nerdy beer guy. <laughs> BJ, I'm so I, glad you're back. Are you back? So, I'm so pumped to be here. You got to be back. Yeah, there was a hiatus. There was a break. and um, I tonight, want honest reviews, though, and I feel like we gave it to you. I you mean, know, so here, here's the thing. I got really excited to have multiple palates trying the beers. 
Yeah. Because I love damn near every beer. And people give me shit about it. And they're like, how can you really love every beer? And I'm like, I, I even asked you. I don't Just love like every beer, but I can appreciate and drink every beer. I, there's not a beer. You taste the crest. You get excited there about might, an I, element maybe in the beer. It's Every it's, beer has a, a element that you like about it. Yes. And I can pick it out. I can avoid and ignore the shit I don't like because if I find or latch on to something I like about it, I'll just dive into that. The other thing about it is making beer is hard. Like, it's a yeah. science. I, I'm not good at it. <laughs> I've tried twice. So you appreciate the whole and fucking the art whole form. The whole process about it. is amazing to me. I just want to try. So you don't want to stuff. shit on someone's no, fucking. No, I don't. Right. Because somebody put effort in and they can't, they get all the way through the process of canning it. There's one place that still I've, I've given two tries <laughs> and I won't say the name of the place. They are in Whitewater, Wisconsin. I just can't get on board. And maybe it's because I haven't tried it out of the tap. Yeah. At the place, I've only had the cans, and there is a possibility where, like, there's some sort of flavor change in the can that's not as good as on tap. I don't know. I'm trying to give them benefit of the doubt. Yeah. Every flavor I've tried from that place, tried. But I feel like is shit. The way you're describing it is like art in a way. Well, yeah. right. Like, for the most part, yes, like, it is. It's a craft. I don't want to shit an on art, someone's yes. art piece because they spent time on this. This was their maybe their passion project. 100%. I don't know. But I can look at it and be like, yeah, that fucking sucks. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, nobody. I'm going to be honest. Like, my daughter could fucking do that. It's a bunch of scribbles <laughs> on a fucking piece of paper. Like, no, that's fair. the fuck are you that's talking fair. about? Well, I think sure. there's okay, there. I okay. I but I, I understand. With fear, it can be different. There's no, there's but something the same, I think though. for everybody, right? There is, when it comes to anything, art. True. Like food, drinks, whatever. There's something But I feel everybody. like that's why they, I feel like a lot of beers put out a seasonal, maybe, sure. to gauge on what people like. Yep. Maybe they yeah. like it. And they're like, oh, let's not do that again. Or maybe we'll change it a little bit. Sure. And the next season we'll come out with something else. Here's the thing. If I put on an outfit and I look like a fucking biscuit, just a busted <laughs> can of biscuits. First of all, I love biscuits. So I don't no, know if that's, a busted what are you trying to say? can of biscuits. Okay. I like, like I just should not be wearing that outfit. Okay. Thank I you for need, that point because a busted yeah. can of biscuits to me is I like, need I, sounds my good to friends. Me. I need my friends to truthfully, like, I need All you to look right. at me. I see where you go. And say, Kayla, don't worry. I love you. <laughs> Do not wear that. For the love of God, Kayla. Wait, is like, that a term that women uh, say? A busted can? Yeah, it's a yes. busted can of biscuits. I need you to truthfully it, look at me and be like, <laughs> You cannot wear that. It's, it's, I love you. You know when you twist the biscuits? It's not, and then, okay. it's not flattering. <laughs> it's it's the muffin top plus. Yes, like yes. it's not flattering. Okay, thank Those you. Because my God, I could embarrass the shit out of myself, right? Yeah. So I feel like the same thing when it comes to food and beer. You right. need the truth. Yeah. Your shit tastes like asshole. But I don't know. Everybody's palate's different because yeah. right. honestly, if, I like to eat a busted can. Yeah, and some people if, eat ass. But if, <laughs> but if ninety-eight, let's be honest, some people eat ass. But if ninety-eight percent for pleasure. Of, okay, hang on. <laughs> oh, she's 90, trying to make a point. Here we go. If ninety-eight out of a hundred people say, "Hey, Kayla, you look like a busted can of biscuits," I'd be like, "All right, bitch, I believe you. Thank you." And I would never wear it again. I really hate that that's a term because I really No, it's this. hilarious, though. So if 98 out of 100 people taste this beer and they're yeah. like, it tastes like shit. Sure. Okay, as the person that brewed it, I'd be like, all right, obviously, we're not going to do this again. We need to be better. Fair. That is fair. So I and feel we'll, like people next need, season we'll try people something need new. truthful right. critics. There is something for everybody. Mm -hmm. But if most of the people that try it, Think but, it tastes like butthole. It tastes like butthole. I don't know. Fix it. Because like, uh, <laughs> I feel like the movie like critics Eddie's. back in the day, like Cisco and Ebert, uh, they were great movie critics, but they didn't like the movies that I, love, I, love I like. I like fucking, I want to go. 
You know and what I'm saying? Like, I, I like off-brand comedies, and they're like, I don't like this mm. movie, and I, I love the fucking movie. It was two thumbs so, down for Ninja Turtles. Let's just remember that. So I, Are you I feel me? like that's that's how it was for oh. for beer. I feel like if we were beer critics, like the care. people would fucking hate us. No, but yeah, this but doesn't taste like Miller Lite. Like, like, we would this, be a Cisco <laughs> neighbor. Two Where's thumbs the down. Life flavor. My point, but my point Dude. is, is if like 98 out of 100 people think that your movie, your comic, your fucking beer, your whatever mm -hmm. yep. tastes like shit, is shit, whatever, then it's shit. Like, it's, it is what it is. Okay. Fix it. Or run with it. Or be like, because that's how Malort's made. Oh, God. Damn. Right, which nobody likes Malort. No, but I've they sell it by do, the and it, they, they make so much but money. But they do because then understand. like I feel like it's like a I don't even know how to It's like a uh, fear things. factor. Like a yes. like a It's a joke thing, right? Like you're like we're all going to take word? a shot of Malort. Well, I'm just trying to think of the fact like um So obviously Cisco and Ebert probably didn't give Happy Gilmore a shouting review, but probably I not. fucking love that movie. Right, but you're talking. So you're died. talking about two critics. Right, but, but two they were world renowned. The, okay, the prestige. But but that's two TV. people. I don't know. Two people. Yeah. Out of how fucking many? She has a point, and this is that is what I, that's all I'm trying to say is oh, right. that ninety. So we are just out of two people judging. Right, so that's what I okay. mean. That's what I mean. It's not them. It's me. I don't like it. So if I am the two people Taylor's out of breaking up these beer companies right now. No, it's, it's not it's you. Me. It's me. It's me. Like I need no. my. I need room to grow. If ninety eight percent of your fucking people like your beer, then fantastic. Yes. I'm the two percent that does not. Fair. Keep doing what you're doing. Right. Whatever. But if ninety eight percent of the people don't like it, fix it. Because yes. you fucked up. <laughs> Yeah, you might you might think your beer's delicious, and then ninety eight out of a hundred people drink it. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. I think we gotta fan you down, Jesus Christ. You okay, babe? <laughs> you got really amped up. Yeah, yeah she got it. Up. Well, I'm See? just saying, like, I don't. So, all but, right, beer but, companies, step up your we, fucking shit. Can but, we? Kayla's coming use? for you. No, but also uh, it's it's uh, me. It's just me. Can we agree <laughs> to use that philosophy in everything, though? Yeah. You you mentioned movies, you mentioned comics, you mentioned all this stuff. Yeah. And I mean it's really true. Like you're always gonna have people that don't like your shit. Right. No matter what your shit is. Right. So there's always gonna be haters. Exactly. Oh man. But if Keyboard most people warriors. hate it. Big fan. If most people, <laughs> sure, but like Determining that is actually true. But what's to most define. people are you the people. Sales, well, I just look. broke it down in a very simple number. Wow. Well, I know, but I'm not the type <laughs> of person that would voice my opinion. So is it just people who are griping? Yeah. That is just the loud, voice their opinion? Are the loud the people loudest actually voices? The majority or like, no? I would see something and be like, nah. Okay. Like, I, I'm not the type of person if I got a product off of Amazon. I'm I, not going to write a fucking review. I, I can care fucking less. It shows up at my house. It's great. I don't know how more simple to break this down. I got you, babe. We all understand what the fuck you're talking about. Yeah, we, we get it. We it's get just, it. It's, so what, it's just like, not how Jeff does. It's not I know how Jeff's he's not. That's not right. how I operate. Yeah. This is the most intense start off to the podcast I think I've ever seen. Oh, I just I don't know how to break it down excited. anymore. Fired up. Ka Kayla had Kayla's. a nice is having a nice adrenaline dump right now after <laughs> I just, I after, after getting a brush out of Bella's hair for the last <laughs> half hour. Oh my god! I didn't think I was gonna be Ooh. able to get that fucking thing yeah, out. It was, I was concerned. It was. In I there was. Deep, like. I had to like YouTube. I was like, how do you get a roller brush out of a like out of hair? And this we bitch Googled made it, it look so easy. And I was like, that's. Not how that works. Sean's like, just get it wet. Just get it wet. It's no, which, Is yes. Is that how you do, Sean? Yes. He was, you're not wrong. <laughs> oh. Not like that. Not like that. Oh. Whoa. Hefe. Whoa. Shower head. <laughs> Very concerned. <laughs> Even more water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> the, but Bella had that thing to the scalp. That was cranked damn. down like she Dude, was trying and she's to. Crying. No, we basically threw that brush out. I looked at her. I said, "You're never going to touch that again, right?" And she goes, "No." 
And I said, good. It's a very. Because <laughs> next time we're going to have to cut your hair. Like, Ooh. that is it. Circle brush. It's a learned lesson. It was. I, look out. I felt bad. I did. Yeah. I, I, I was, I was, cause I was looking and at we were up there for a while. Yeah. I was, she was uh, crying. In, she, in I mean, all honesty, in my mind, I was going, how'd you get the beans above the Frank? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 100%. Cause I was like, oh no. I, it, it was, there was one point where you saw where it went in, but then she had it wrapped yeah, over but- the opposite direction. Then wrap back that's the other circle brushes, brushes hey, yeah, work. That's how those work, and that's the tricky thing about that's them. Like dangerous. I did, I did that as a child. I feel like many girls do that as a child because you think like a brush, right? You brush your hair. Mm-hmm. You take one of those roller brushes <laughs> and you try to brush your hair, and then like I don't know what it is when you're when you're young. Look, Mama's over there trying to pet us on the t- on the oh. screen. <laughs> The cat is pawing at the monitor. Oh, at no. Our faces. Watch, uh, pull it. She's not even paying attention no, now. No, 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 she's tired. No, no, she's she's past it. She is. But anyways, we got Belle's hair out. She's good. It's good. And she it's will good. never touch that brush and again. we survived also, the... Hey, uh, congratulations. Your uh, big uh, parenting milestone. You took the boys and Bella to a, a concert. Ooh, like, yes. Great. A concert yes. concert. Talk about that. So. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's some shit. Like, the rave is good. a big deal. No, it was cool. So, like, I had looked at these tickets. Well, we brought months. Bella's first concert was, what, the used? Well, yeah, when, I was, pre- when I was pregnant. She her. was pregnant. I was oh. pregnant. Oh I tried to Bella's clean. been to two concerts oh. prior to being born. Yeah, she uh, saw Bayside. And, Bayside. Uh, and, and then the used. used. Damn, Gina. Yeah. Um, but so I had looked at the tickets for Brothers Osborne a couple months ago. And not that, like, we couldn't afford to go, but I was like, God damn, over $200. Like, it was almost like 300 sure. bucks for Concerts five of us. On a Thursday, Plus I'm parking. like, ah, I'm yeah. like, I don't, oh, I'm not gonna do it. Whatever. Well, my best friend's uh, sister works for the rave, right um, and was gracious enough to be like, hey, get your tickets. Dude, and I was like, oh my god, like the kids would love this. And she's, I mean, I've known her since she was younger than the boys, even younger than Bella. Um, so she got us tickets. Whatever, we went. And the kids, like, I mean, they had a good time. Uh, yeah, they did. Like, so Trey it's normally cool is so place, like introverted. It's a great He's venue. Quiet. Yeah, I mean for sure. But he like, all of a sudden I saw him moving after a while, was and he then he was, it? and then he was singing. Well, I and told I him like, too. Yes. Like, I mean, that's a big. <laughs> see, that's the musician. When you can be comfortable at a concert to get into it, when yeah. you can really connect with the music and the people on the stage, and not give a fuck about. Anybody around yes. Yes. watching you, that is worth everything about. So it. they're going to see a concert. And they're gonna go see NF, and they they know his music. Okay, because it's different when you go see a concert and you don't really know his music. Sure, I, sure. I feel like so yeah. he's kind of he got into it, but he couldn't really get into yeah. it. Okay. So, but they yeah. knew like so. The funny thing is like I because I was like the boys would love this because that's the music they like. So I brought it up, and they're like, I don't know, Brothers Osborne. I was like, what? What? Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. What? And so then I played a couple of songs. They're like, "Oh no, I know those songs." So okay. they knew some of their songs. Um, but <laughs> yeah, at first Trey was just like sitting there because that's just him. <laughs> yeah, very just weird. quiet. Just yeah, weird. he's just he's that's just okay. quiet and very introverted. Whatever. Um, but towards the end, yeah, he started moving Get and singing, moves. and I was like, yes. There it is. He's, he's, concerts are fun as shit. You gotta they find really your are. you gotta find your thing, and concerts might be his. Some people love yeah. going dead nuts up front. Some people are all about in the standing back. in the back and observing, and it doesn't. Younger, matter. I liked up front. So I will yeah. say, and then the older I've got, you go back. The back. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I like so the exit row. We yeah. stood at the rave. We stood. The bathroom. We went all yep. the way to the left I, side yes. of the ballroom, over by like the mm-hmm. women's bathroom. Mm-hmm. Yep. And we stood back there, right, like by the two steps. I call them stairs. <laughs> two steps. Well, that's right, because we were on the main level, and I was yeah. like, well, like Bella couldn't. We see walked shit. around, yeah, and obviously around the around the stage, it has the step up. So at least yeah, I so we see. stood we stood back there. But like I said, like if we ever take the kids back, we're going early. 
And they're crowd And surfing. we are going right up, up front. front. Yep. We are right up front there. It's an experience you won't regret. Like, right. Or you won't forget, I should say. You might regret it, but you won't. <laughs> oh, we will <laughs> always forget. regret it, but you won't forget There's it. There's regrets and everything. Don't forget you got a microphone in front of you too, buddy. Sorry, I get excited. You <laughs> fucking get really no, I do the same thing. I'm always moving and talking. <laughs> so what's up in the life of BJ? Hey. How are we doing? Life's good. Life is interesting. What are you working on nowadays? Stuff. Like what? <laughs> he can't tell you. It's a secret. No, I and I totally forgot to bring it, actually. Did I, you? Yeah, I did. I okay, it's it okay. Enough. But um, so for the past 20-ish years, um, been working on a comic book idea. And I say 20-ish years because it's like you sprinkle ideas in and you don't really give it the full attention that you should. It's kind of dabble. Yeah, you're like, yeah. oh, you know, that reminds me of something cool. I'm going to make a note about that. And then you look at all these notes, and you're like, I should really do something with this. <laughs> but the story of where this started is actually pretty interesting. Um, so Richard Blake, who is like my movie producing partner, he he um, who has a movie coming out very soon, uh, April 5th on Apple looks TV. Looks good as it's shit. It's called The Actor. <laughs> There's a little plug for him. Go yeah. check it out. Go check it out. Yeah, it, it looks, looks fucking good. I haven't fun. seen it. I'm very excited to see it. So I read and the Blame was and fucking. Blame was, was fucking awesome. That was man. fun. That was a good one. Like to just. That was a fun one to make. But. So go watch Blame. Yeah. Thank you. That's out on fucking <laughs> uh, Amazon. Amazon right now. Um, Amazon Prime. In fact, why don't you go buy it? Yeah, that'd be cool. Why don't you go pay for just it? Just go buy it. Yeah. Don't be bitches. Don't be streaming oh, it for shoot. for your nine dollar a month <laughs> Prime Premium. <laughs> Go buy it. Spend your hard earned money. Support Go. a local artist. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. I I I like. <laughs> can I? I'm gonna be your friend right now. Can, I like blame. <laughs> He's gonna be the two the two percent. Here we go. Here it comes. I liked blame uh-huh. when I first watched it, uh-huh. but I liked it better when I watched it the second time. Oh, really? I, yes. Oh, that's because then I can, I notice you everything start else. Start pinpointing yes. those things. Because the first time I watched it, I felt. Go. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, I felt like it. underwhelmed. Okay. The first time I watched it, because I thought there was going to be some grand don't thing spo- or don't person spoil it. or <laughs> yes, but you need to go watch it. But the second time I watch it, knowing the ending, uh-huh. and then I get psychoanalyze. All the shit between the characters, I liked it a lot better. That's awesome. That yeah. actually makes me happy. <laughs> because rewatchability. Yes. That's important. Yes. Like, so like every time I watch it, I was like, oh, fuck. Like, yeah. You Did I ever tell you things? where that all came from? Like, where that idea came from? Did I Identity. Ever... Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, and when you go watch that movie, it's like watching Fight Club. You well, we watch don't talk it about f- it. Yeah, I was going to say, you stop that. it. We don't touch <laughs> that. That was so good. You <laughs> walked right into it, buddy. Man, I really I set myself up for that. that. Yeah. Uh, what I, yeah the movie you know what rule number yeah. one is? Well, I guess I got to <laughs> change And rule topic. number two? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, for Fuck sure. Tyler Durden. For sure. Here we go. <laughs> so when you watch it the second time, it's a different experience. Because, because you, you know, know the, the ending. ending. You know the outcome, yes. And and for you to say that, was a that's a big compliment because... Um, I don't know how to put it in words. Like that just means a lot that you actually went and watched it again. No, because <laughs> honestly, well, no, dude, you you, you study the characters in a different in you a different way. I feel time. like you know. <laughs> I liked it better the second time. If I That's if great. I can be completely honest, the second time I watched it, I liked it more. Yeah, That's and cool. and honestly too, when we watched it in the theater. I was so focused on I was focused on watching the movie, but I was back there was my, a lot of excitement around back, and also back in my head I'm like, dude, I gotta go do interviews. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I had to walk around and interview like sixty people. Yeah. You met everybody. Hey, it that was, was fun. Eventually eventually BJ will uh, show some of them be real I footage. Cut that shit together. There's so much footage. <laughs> we, got so good, good. we got some good we got some good be real footage. I did like the shortest highlight cut together video ever of that, but you're right, I need to. Um at least so yeah, the comic book. Yes. 
So back in 2000, I moved to LA in 2004. Prior to that, Richard calls me and he's like, hey, dude, I'm up. Did I ever tell you this story? I don't think so. He's like, I'm up for this role for a TV pilot with Stan Lee. And I'm like, what? Like the Stan Lee? We yeah. Him comic book legend? He's like, yeah, I have to create a comic book character. Otherwise, uh, I can't be on the show. Like, I have to come up with my own original idea. And so call my comic book nerd friend. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the only one he called. And he's like, dude, I need your help. We got to create this. I'm like, okay, cool. What are you thinking? He's like, I don't know. Let's do this, that, the other, whatever. Long story short, we came up with the protector. And the protector was he gets his power from, like, like he's angelic in a way. Like, he's got this shield and sword, and he's like a badass, and he, mm -hmm. whatever. And so he, he goes on the show, and they... They literally create a costume for him, which is super cheesy. No and shit. Like big, puffy, armored, <laughs> like, you know, you see Almost the like paintings. You see the paintings of, like, Michael the Archangel with yeah. the breastplate and shit. Yeah. Like, he's walking around Los Angeles in the silver, <laughs> full-blown <laughs> outfit. There's video of this stuff no still shit. out there. Yeah, I'll, sh I'll find it. It's... It's amazing. Anyway, so he goes on the show, and they, they're like, okay, you're the protector. And there's like 12 other comic book characters that these people have created for themselves. Was this that reality was show? It, a it was a, it was a okay. pilot competition reality show. It didn't get past the first pilot. It didn't make it publicly. They talked about it on like sci-fi or something. I feel like they promoted it they a bit. They promoted it. I think it was almost going to be on MTV, actually, but... What ended up happening is his character in the first episode, the, the whole deal was like, you have to go do these um, tasks. You have to do superhero <laughs> things yeah. and save people or help people or whatever. So Richard somehow is in a grocery store, and he's got to go do something, but... And is he, he slashing prices? You know, <laughs> I God, love, I, I can, love can that. Can you show up right now? <laughs> oh um, my God, I love him. So right, Have produce wow, eggs. <laughs> Bring them back. Four fifty, no dollar <laughs> fifty. <laughs> so like, he shows up and he's walking around the grocery store, and some smoking beautiful woman goes, "What are you doing?" <laughs> and he looks and he's like. I <laughs> and the way they shoot it is like a yeah. camera behind a shelf. <laughs> but he's mic'd up and yeah. you know whatever. And they're like, he's like, well, I'm actually doing this reality show, and you know, blah 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 blah. And Stanley's like, you can't give your identity away. Oh, You're oh, out of here. Like he got booted off yeah. the show. Oh, dude, no. it was awesome. It was amazing. <laughs> he's in front of Stan. Stan's mad, and he's like, I've lost my power, dude. And it was <laughs> damn <it>. epic. <laughs> The whole but, point of that was we had this idea for a character, not that specific <laughs> yeah. version of the character. <laughs> but we started talking about ideas, and the show like Supernatural came out, and I'm a huge X-Men fan, as you know, and it, it, oh, it, yeah. it all started to, if I was going to do a comic book, if we were going to do a comic book, and he's a huge Superman fan, we were talking about all this stuff, we were like, well, what if... What if we did a crossover idea where it wasn't just one guy, it was a group of people, men and women, everything. And it's like supernatural where you're dealing with the heaven and hell demons and angels and all that kind of battle. But there's also the X-Men quality where these people are born with these abilities and powers, but they're more supernatural powers. Almost like, like if you get into Ghost Rider, you get into Moon Knight, or you get yeah, into those yeah. types of characters, it gets dark and to some yeah. serious shit. So, the whole point, the project. I feel like that's the root of all of it. Is you know, good versus evil. Absolutely. Mean, even though the yeah. X Men you is all chopped any, up. Any filter on it, you can put any layer on it, whatever you want to call it. But it's it's all good versus evil, and how is this going to be different than everything else? And um. It was the idea of, you, you were talking about beer. You were talking about what is everybody like, what is everybody not like, whatever. But can you make something that you like and kind of fuck what everybody else thinks? Because yeah, fuck it. if yeah. you want to make, when it comes to art, if you want to yeah. make something that's your own jam. For sure. Just really get it out. So 
Kind of like this podcast. Hey. Fuck what everybody else thinks. We don't give a shit. We're going to do this every week. I want to. (laughs) Dude, I put this thing on my phone. I pop it up, and I, like, do shit around the house. I love this stuff. So. (laughs) I'm so um, sorry. (laughs) (laughs) Nice. Oh, there it is. There it is. So, what it came down to was, like, if I'm going to do this, if, you know, Richard's making the actor, which is coming out soon, he's busy with that. I was like. I need to come up with an idea to lay it out and kind of get it all out in a story and, and just execute it. And so I worked with an artist that I've never met in person. I don't even know what the hell he looks like. <laughs> His name is uh, Lewis Thomas. I think he's got two first might names. be a, might be a fake name. That's definitely a fake know. name. Could That's two first could names. Be, could be the pen name. <laughs> God, is it Thomas? Now I feel like an ass. So you've had a guy writing your comic. No, no, no. (laughs) I've been writing it. Drawing your comic. He's been coming up with the concept artwork, and so I I give him all the character information, and here's the people, and blah, blah, blah. I was like, can you just come up with, like, the cover art concept art? You know, like, bad guy in the background, bunch of good guys in the front, you know, whatever. And we spent a whole year. All of 2023 was working on this, and it was back and forth. It was not stressful. It was not on any timeline, which was actually really nice. He was busy. He's a college student that pays his way through college by doing commission artwork like this. And, uh, was he a comic fan too? I think he's yeah. out in the East coast. I don't really know where he's located. I think anyway, what I didn't hear. What you is said. he into the comics or is he Oh, just, he's totally yeah. like okay. diehard. And the reason I found him is through Instagram. I feel like you don't want to find someone who's just good at art. No, you want to find dude, someone who's like you want to find a comic book. Head. He yeah, started. Yeah. I I found samples of his work on Instagram, and he was just like he was doing X Men, and he was doing Spider Man, he was doing Venom, he was doing these characters in such a really badass dark way. And I'm like, ooh, I like your style. This is really cool. So how do you start though? Do you start with like a story? Yes. Or do you start with the visuals? Like, how do you want it? So, because I feel like comic it, books are very. Obviously, the visuals in there. It's big. It's important. It, the visuals kind of tell the story in a way. Yes. Right? Um, and I've never done this. So I don't know what the proper way is. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. But how did you start? Like, so are you I, just a, had a vision? This is what I'm thinking of for the characters. And yes. And then I was like, I need help because I don't know how to get it from point A to from my mind point to B. the paper. Like, let's just get, how do we get to Z? But I need to go to A to B first. Yeah. And so Angie and I actually, you know, we wrote this. So she's a very good writer. And we wrote this whole first, I guess it's like the first book, I guess you could call it. Um, it's 44 pages of a, a script that's pretty intense. And so she's like, all right, what are you going to do with this? I'm like, I'm going to take it. I'm going to run with this guy. I'm going to see what the we can come up with yeah. and let's see what happens and this dude was like yo he read it and he's like this is crazy like <laughs> i'm in and he starts drawing this stuff on a sketch pad and he's sending me pictures and i'm like yo man like oh okay this is really cool this is exciting and at the what it was a month ago i think i sent you a picture yeah i got the final artwork back he sent me the the original sketch on this giant you know whatever size board it is and then a digitized colored final print and we were using the name the sanctified we don't we had multiple titles and all this stuff but we're working with that one right now yeah and it was quite an experience it was freaking crazy oh, shit. it was absolutely unreal <laughs> and i'm That's sitting there now wild, i'm trying dude. to buy frames because i'm like i want to put this shit up in my house like this is really cool <laughs> yeah. well it's one-on-one it, yeah, yeah like it's just it's wild to like hold it in your hand after like you have this idea 20 years yeah it's like 20 years ago with a buddy and then you see it in your hands like it's a it's a really surreal feeling but now it's a matter of I got to find somebody who's an artist that can do like the page and panel work Mm -hmm. yeah, and the dialogue and how do we take it from, cause we wrote it in like movie script format. Cause that's all we really know how to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, it's, that's where we're at. So are you going full color or are you going to go grimy? It's going to be, it's going to be full color. (laughs) It's not going to be like Ninja Turtles where they did black and white in the original. 
Um, I really want to do full color. But the other thing, too, is like, so much, so many oh, thoughts on this. Like, I just want to make sure that it. What's, wait, what's going on? Jeff's mic, mic fell off. <laughs> He's just trying to fix it. It's gone limp. <laughs> Sorry, about don't that. worry about me. They make pills for that. It's okay. <laughs> um, Blue Chew, not a sponsor. <laughs> oh no! Oh, my what's God. happening? I'm just gonna hold it. Just rest it. Don't worry, we only got like a half hour, 45 minutes left. It's okay. No, it's fine. We're good. <laughs> His arm's going to fall asleep. Just I forgot what I was talking what about. What are you? <laughs> hey, bro. Woo. Go team. <sighs> so this is also our first podcast with four people, so we're kind of figuring out <laughs> layout of the studio, if it's you will. It's wonderful. The audio's fine. Yeah. yeah, you're good. I'm still here. It don't matter. <laughs> Just don't it's watch the video. That's fine. No, nah, we're watching the video. <laughs> it's fucking so, uh, yeah. hot mess. Point point out exactly where <laughs> Jeff's life <laughs> fell apart on the podcast. I'm so excited for At this. this moment. So the sanctified. That's actually a. I, I'm 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 into it. I'm ready to I'm ready to I'm ready to check it out once you get it. Rock and roll. I'll show you uh, pictures and stuff when. Uh, What's well, the? Yeah. Well, to you. That's dope. It is yeah. fun. That's cool. I'm excited. The. Oh. Um, uh oh. Oh. Hold on. Oh my god. Hello. Morning. Do not disturb. What can I <laughs> what can I do for you? Okay. Can you go back upstairs for just a little bit? Now we got two daughters. I dig Bye it. You. I dig it. It's not the cats this time. It's the daughter. It's the daughter. Yes, please. I have the same basket. The Thank you. Brings them to me too. Yeah, no, oh, well, it it's perfect. silly. We always provide the Easter Bunny with baskets every year. Because why we would recycle. the Easter Bunny bring I mean, us new baskets? I mean, when we have right, we don't so just throw, around. otherwise we'd have to throw them away right. every year. And that is a waste. So we keep Play them. Money. We keep them so Reduce, that the Easter Bunny doesn't reuse, right. recycle. So yes, put what them upstairs this, on the counter, please. Yeah, right. This goes back Thank you. To, Thank you, baby. <laughs> It's 10 o'clock. Do you know your Thank you, baby. <laughs> Love you. Do you know how many people don't believe that was a real commercial? <laughs> that shit was so real. <laughs> I used to just quote it because I'd be home and I didn't know where my parents were. Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know where my mom and dad are. <laughs> they know where I it's am. 10 o'clock. Do you know where your children are? Man, people don't understand. Oh. We lived outside in the woods. Or <laughs> It's crazy. Um, wow. We we were fucking feral children, man. That's just what feral. we were. That's a good way to put it. Yeah, that's what I told the bouncer last night. I said, my wife's in there. She's a feral cat. <laughs> <laughs> I put fucking milk he outside, did. and I'm just hoping she comes back for it. Oh, oh no, he did though. He did. Hundred oh, percent. He's like, yeah, no, she's feral. Back, I was like, I I this is this the feral cat? I'm like, oh yeah, <laughs> we're out of here. <laughs> Let's go, baby. <laughs> It's time. <laughs> it's so true. <laughs> <laughs> it is so true. I I love the fact that Jeff is just like, yeah, that's that, that's that's mine. That's my <laughs> wife. You see that bitch over there? Yeah. She's gonna fight that retard. <laughs> <laughs> and then oh, we're no. out of here. Chop <laughs> no. punch I got in the face. Oh my god, we went to walk back oh. into the bar and I looked at the bouncer and I'm trying to find my ID. And I was like, You're not gonna card me again, right? And he goes, no, I no. saw you earlier, and I said, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> and I just rubbed I'm my beard. I it. said, you're not going to garb me, are you? <laughs> Happy Easter. Holla. Oh. Holla. Holla at your I'm boy. At Holla at your I'm boy. At that weird Holla at your age. boy. Kale like, almost fought someone with Down syndrome. Oh, no, you stop it. Club. You don't say that. Oh, he no. did not have Down syndrome. <laughs> you're going to punch him in the face. He, he might did. have been albino. He oh, definitely was maybe albino. <laughs> But he did not have Down syndrome. Either way, it's a hate crime, Kayla. Jesus. <laughs> it's not a hate crime. It's not a hate crime. He was maybe albino. Like, in the redhead form of albino. Mm. I and I say that. that speaking as being a redhead, and my little brother's a redhead. Yeah, so this she can't be racist to redheads. Because she is a redhead. She's not a, to redheads. She's yeah, a bit no. of a day walker, if you will. <laughs> This dude had no soul. Not a single soul. 
He took them all. <laughs> Sold me head. Him and, Wen- him, and him and Wendy were in the same yep. category. Dude, no, his eyelashes were so blonde. No, he didn't even look like he had eyelashes. Alopecia. <laughs> no, he <laughs> had God. eyelashes. I saw them, but they were blonde. <laughs> They were just white. Like, he just was not a good looking dude. I don't know and I said, my lady, it's time, it's time to go. We got to go. We got to go. And normally I would have said, yes, you're right. We need to. What was that accent he was doing? I don't know. We got to go. <laughs> we got to go. Where are you from? We got to go. That's his. I'm so nervous because <laughs> Kayla's about to start some shit in the bar. Well, we got to go. That's my Donald Trump. We I, need to go. We got to go. That I can. We got to go. I said. No, he just gets so nervous because he. I looked at him. I said. I'm gonna make, I said, I said I'm going to make him cry. And he goes, no, Kayla, we got to go. And I was like, go. we're going to go. I'm a lover. But first, I'm going to make him cry. I'm a and lover. he's like, no, 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 we need to go. And I said, you wait by the door. I feel like there I'm needs make to be backstory cry. a little bit here. Like, why are you attacking this guy in the Oh, that ugly verbally. motherfucker. Okay, because we went out last night. Here we go. For my little Where's sister's the birthday. There it is. Mm. 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 <laughs> we went and Kayla to a, said that guy right there in the trash hat. No, okay, stop it. Trash. His hat says trash I on it. I can't even explain myself because you just keep talking. <laughs> Let me just from a guy's I mean, point just, of view. I just I just feel like we're like the worst couples therapy session. <laughs> from a ever. guy's <laughs> point of view, that hat that says trash upside on down it. trash. Tell me how you, that, that guy's that a piece of feel. shit, and I was like, oh really? <laughs> The one with the trash hat. He's a piece of okay, shit. Okay, hang on. Let's, but let's bring and it then back. Legitimately, oh, I walk around the bar and he turned his face and I oh, go, no. Kayla. Oh, no. He's oh, retarded. No. Oh, no. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have. <laughs> Is he ma- was he making grilled cheese sandwiches that night? Yes. And hide him in, his, yes. hide him in the I, closet. I mean, he While he was talking. dancing on what the dance floor, he doing? pulled the I'm grilled cheese. I'm going to need his- you to stop pocket. talking. Okay. Kayla has spoken. You're going to tell it better than I'm telling it. Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. So I'm going to need you to stop talking. Oh, my God. Very nicely. I need you to stop talking, please. Right, hold on, my lady. <laughs> the floor is yours. It was my little sister's birthday. Oh, my God. And for some reason, my little sister found this ugly motherfucker not to be ugly. Whatever. Okay. And he made her feel like shit. Mm-hmm. Mm. And so as a big sister, yep. it doesn't matter. Regulate. I looked at him and I said, why are, why are we worried about him? There's nothing cute about him. Why are we worried? Why? But she was worried. She was and worried. And so as her big sister, mm. I said, all right, <laughs> now's my time to shine. <laughs> 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 I'm going to put on my Big sister pants. I'm a and so I went on to the dance. <laughs> Stop oh using god. that word. Oh my god! Yeah. I'm not I... talking, but I like rocks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he had a couple of rocks in his pocket. Dude, you damn sure he did. Oh Can't take god. him anywhere. I know. I know. <laughs> See, no. I feel like BJ feels how no. I feel sometimes when Jeff does this shit. You're like, just don't say it. Hefe. No, I say Hefe. what I see and yeah, how I but feel. No, Hefe. stop. Don't say it again. Shush. Don't say it again. It's like in Single Man where he goes, he shush. Yeah, yeah. Had no eyelashes. Well, he had them, but they were so blind. Whatever. I get what you're saying. Okay. But he was. Describe them without by no saying means, the word. By no means oh my God. did he have a <laughs> single extra need. Mm. So, as a big sister, I confronted him because he made my little sister feel like shit. Now, the motherfucker was ugly. <laughs> I can't. <pour> my- <laughs> I mean, he fucking. <laughs> Surprised he didn't have gold medal around his neck. <laughs> oh my God. Let's be honest. <laughs> He's flashing around the bar <laughs> trying-, <laughs> trying to get some pussy. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> Please roll up and edit this hey, out. Hey, baby. Oh. You wanna edit this out. You wanna oh, suck my the God. chips. You wanna suck the chips, dick. <laughs> oh, my God. Please edit this out. It's so Don't bad. You dare. This is so bad. <laughs> Uh, aren't you glad you decided to come on the show today? <laughs> no, Jeffrey. The day we get canceled? We what? Derailed so no. bad. No. No. Oh, sorry, babe. Stop. <laughs> 
<laughs> We're never getting on Saturday Night Live after this show. Oh, my God. <laughs> fuck, dude. It's too much. Is it's it too much. Sh- You're a lousy man. dick if I was suffocating and there was oxygen in your balls. There it is. <laughs> There All right. Is. Too much. All right. How about that comic book? <laughs> <laughs> so, BJ, you like to make movies, huh? <laughs> you ever hire any special needs folks for your movies, BJ? Oh, or are you kind God. of a... I'm so sorry. Kind of, kind of a bit of an I, asshole when it comes to that. I'm sorry, y'all. No, um, you need to stop. You need really? to stop. Is it that bad? Yes. Yes. 100. Yes. It's just a word. Fuck. Remember oh. earlier? Remember earlier when oh. I was like, if ninety-eight out of a hundred people <laughs> ah. think that it's fucked up, it's clearly fucked up. You mm. sit at that like the extra two that are like, it's not fucked up, and the rest fine. of us are like, it is fucked up. Hey, if you saw what I saw, oh no! <laughs> oh, no. If you can see through Jeff's eyes, there was nothing oh. about this man. That All right. Other than well, he was speaking ugly, of special needs, I got to answer the internet question real quick. Uh, how is too, how old is too old to watch cartoons? There is never. No. No. Exactly. <laughs> how exactly. dare you? So hey, do it now. I'm missing one. Uh oh, Melinda. Great. Now we'll oh, never. That's right there. Now we'll oh never my know. god! You're magical. Magical card on the floor. Whoa. Yeah, there's absolutely no age there. Yeah, by no. the way, X Men '97 came out. Cartoons like, are great. Completely as excited as I was when I was 12. super excited. Oh my! I God. actually started watching the originals. Yeah, burned through as many mm-hmm. of those as I could. Yeah, that's the best part about all that being on HBO or whatever. Disney, Disney, HBO, all of it. You can just when you can watch the yes. 1978 Spider Man oh, cartoon. Dude. Yeah, don't toy with me. <laughs> dare. Watch that shit all the time. I dare really you? Excited. And I get one of these every time I watch it. You're sitting at home watching Why? 1978 Spider Man. Go out, and touch no, grass. That is nothing to be ashamed of. Go outside and touch grass. This is fucking depressing. I I Maybe love, I disagree. No, I love cartoons. I'll watch yes. cartoons till I die. Are we doing? That's are fair. we doing? You're no, I was just throwing one. out to get us off of Jeff talking about dropping yep, the no, hard R. Just, just what are you that? talking no, about? Stop! Stop oh, talking. Here, because I don't know what the hell Room Raiders is. You ready for this? That is very mm-hmm. disturbing. I'm to sad me that about you don't that. Know. If I feel were, like we need a black light. <laughs> I do have one. If you were on an old episode of Room Raiders, what would you be most afraid of being found? Oh, you want me to answer that? Because I, I mean, could go grab it from right over oh, there. Oh, what? Oh, the destroyer? I'm sorry. So, no, no, what? no. We'll so, show that after. We're, my, we're not getting taken off YouTube just no, yet. But, so for my bachelorette party, my... Oh. My uh, oh. family and friends thought it would be hilarious to get a giant John Holmes life like dildo. Dong. Oh. Now it stands about if I suction cupped it to this table, it stands probably about it's this tall. Damn, it's like maybe fourteen solid. inches, fifteen inches. It's fucking hilarious. Wow, it's hilarious, and there were so many jokes around it. And so, like for my birthday, we had our fake prom, and. <laughs> the dogs have this long like chew toy <laughs> huh? the guys were like don't trip over the black dildo <laughs> and so jade and i looked at each other and we were like dildo and so i went and i grabbed this thing because we had it hiding upstairs and so i walked down the stairs with it and i handed it to jeff like it was a bouquet right and so anyways it stayed down here bella had friends over i said jeffrey you need to hide that motherfucker like there's Until, yeah, the children no one goes in there Whatever. They go into the cabinet that he hid it in, and they saw it. Oh, no. They uh, saw it. Failed as a parent. So. Why were they in goes, the cabinets? I, why were they in the cabinets? Children. Because they're, they're kids. Hide and see. No. Because they're kids. And then go to find out, because Bella had my old phone. She's like, yeah, no, I saw it. I saw that on one of the old pictures. And I was like, why do you just, why are you going through Damn. everything? Some things you don't need to see. Hey, and she goes, but why do you have that? Because it's funny. I said, because your <laughs> aunts thought it would be funny. 
I don't know how else to explain this. So throw everybody else under the bus. Not God just, damn it. Not this. Yeah. M- mom, mom really enjoys having <laughs> this giant no. future destroying dong Wait, is that the thing the I saw house? hanging from the ceiling? Yes. Yes. Came down? yes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get it out for you later. Yes. Don't you worry, BJ. Because we stuck it. We stuck it. Like, Ooh. as soon as you come down the stairs, we stuck it to the ceiling. So when you Does came down, if you weren't paying attention. Grand? Never mind. Oh boy! If that's if, if that's if, if that's what you gotta I'm take down for the fifty grand, grand I uh, my jaw don't hit uh, yeah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> My gag reflex oh is terrible. My God. It's horrible. <laughs> it's horrible. I don't brush my tongue. Uh, mine would be. <laughs> mine you guys would, brush your tongues. Room Raiders. <laughs> what I'd be worried about is uh, the gun in my nightstand. Because that would probably freak someone out when they open the nightstand. Okay. There's a 45 I sitting there. There's a question. Here. I, feel, yeah. I feel like I'd be more right. worried about the giant the gun. So the beast suction my cup gun. dildo. Gun. I, if I had a giant suction cup dildo at my house, I mean, I'd understand it too. He's crying. What are you? What would you be afraid of? Probably the socks. <laughs> <laughs> it looking like a Jackson Pollock painting as soon as that <laughs> black white hit. <laughs> Just glowing in the oh. dark. <laughs> Just glowing everywhere. How is it on the ceiling fan? <laughs> That's where I prefer. <laughs> this guy just can't leave himself alone. Oh my God. <laughs> Sir, I'm taking you yeah. to court against yourself. I can't breathe. Literally, uh, yeah. <laughs> Sir, how do you have any fluids left in your body? <laughs> It's you, remember, your... you remember the movie Major League? Oh, yeah. When he hung the socks up. Oh, no. Where no, he the stole gloves. the base. The yeah. gloves. Well, I hung up socks. You hung your socks up like, <laughs> oh, my God. like you were steal- like you were Willie Mays Hayes stealing bases. Yeah. Every another... nut you busted in a Larry, <laughs> Larry Bird oh, tube God. sock. <laughs> Got <laughs> nailed to the wall. His tube sock. <laughs> 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 Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh once God. again we did sample 10 plus beers yeah. and <laughs> may or Grandma, may not stay Wait. out of my room <laughs> I told you a thousand times <laughs> Wait, BJ what would you be worried about I don't know my fucking Lord of the Rings shorts? I don't know, man. Like, oh, those are rookie got numbers. Shit. I got, got weird gotta... shit in there, but... Those are rookie no, numbers. Like, those are rookie numbers. You gotta pump those numbers yeah, up. I gotta think about this. I don't really have... The Blacklight Jackson Pollock painting <laughs> no. job. Dude, you really don't remember Room Raiders? No. It was on the same oh block as like that next show where it was the dating when oh, they get off yeah, the so bus. Good. Yeah, they go See through later. everybody's yeah. shit and then they'd bring out the black light. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <It's> like, <what? laughs> oh, yeah. no. God that, forbid well, you I drool. Mean, the, the bedroom I'm not worried about. The bathroom, you just got very oh, English when bathroom. you talked about your room. Oh, That shower no. train's oh, glowing. No. <laughs> so what's, oh, what's that, radioactive? <laughs> yeah, what's the water in Twin <laughs> Lakes, Ninja dude? Turtles down that drain? What's going on? <laughs> nope. Yeah, just mind your business, okay? It's going to be fine. <laughs> Caviar dreams. <laughs> <laughs> I, I still think they should have called oh. Aquaman semen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Really? <laughs> Seaman? Seaman. 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 Seaman and what? <laughs> what, is what was it called? His trusty sidekick chode. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh my god. Seaman oh, in the forbidden fuck. back door. <laughs> oh my god. The Justice League has been ruined. Batman, I'm sorry. Oh, Happy man. birthday to you. 85 years. We just Dude. did that. We did. <laughs> hey, man. I make jokes about shit. Yeah, that's uh-huh. true. And when it's when it's shitty, it's even funnier. Yeah. What was the worst version of Aquaman? Uh, the one from Entourage or, the, or just Jason Momoa? Uh, last one. I mean, Entourage, no, technically, that was the greatest that. selling movie of Don't all time. Don't you dare talk Do you want to know Jason Momoa. who the first live action Aquaman was. Have you seen that show Reacher? Yes. Yeah. That guy. Really? In Smallville. Okay. Do you remember the show Smallville? Yeah. 
that actor played Aquaman. Alan Rickman show. is that is not yeah. Alan Rickman. That that's Snape. Or, but it's like Richmond or something. Yeah, it's Richardson, something, something like that. I don't know his name. Yeah. Um, he was he was dude. Thad dude, Castle in crazy Blue Mountain ripped. State. That guy was just he's yes. huge now. Thad Castle in Blue Mountain Destined State. For is that Blue right. Mountain State? Have you seen Blue Mountain no, State? I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, you need to watch <laughs> Blue Mountain State. Okay, Oksana. Wow. The pocket pussy. Yeah, it is phenomenal. Wow. Okay. Oh, it's it's about a college football team, and it's worth. Yeah, and he is the dumb jock. He is the the captain. Captain of the Line, football middle team. linebacker, yeah. dumb jock. It is so Holy good. Shit. Sorry, the beer just hit me in a weird way, and I yawned. <laughs> That's I okay. Is there, it's delicious. Well, there not even a lot the beer. Of it's just all the dirt weed that was in the beer. It's ditch weed. That it's guy was just weed. one of those guys that was just. <laughs> he was always going to be famous no matter you can what. Argue yeah, forever. strong jaw. I love I mean, he was on a, wasn't he on American strong Idol? Job? He was on American Idol. Who was, what is happening right now? Who was? I don't know. Hey, hang on. I do have a question for all of you. Blue Mountain yeah. State guy was on American Idol. BJ. What? Shit. If you could make your girlfriend's breasts as large as you want it, mm. but mm. yours would be man. the same size, <laughs> how big would you go? C cup. Let's go. B. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. B cup. I don't want matching C. B cups. I yeah, do I'm not want that. C's. <laughs> if they gotta match mine, I'm content. I'm Y'all gotta got, You have I, to have matching titties. No, nope, I'll go B. I'm going all the way. I'm gonna shower. I don't know what, what that you means. Doing double D's. Oh what, yeah. What, what do you mean all the way? What does that mean? I, that's right. all the way. I'm go. Let's go deep. <laughs> Jeff just wants. Jeff I'll wants shower to shower myself. S- <laughs> suck every dick for a thousand oh, bucks, wow. and he right, wants giant dicks. Jeff, is there something you want to tell us? So if you haven't you seen... You want giant tits and you want to... Last week's podcast, you should <laughs> oh, check no. that out. I watched that. And I feel I like I'm that guy from uh, Sons of Anarchy. And then what? tonight what? at the bar... What guy? Please, for the love of God, clarify what guy. might not even be a guy. I'm, Who uh, knows? Wait, what? What? What are you, Peg Bundy from... <laughs> <laughs> Sons of Anarchy. Who are we talking Bundy. about? The guy... With the tits. <laughs> wow. The guy with the tits. Wow. Are you sure you're not talking about Fight Club? Club? No. Oh, not Bob. <laughs> it's Bob. Big tits, Bob. Oh. Bob we don't talk about tits. Fight Club this on this Bob. fucking Bob podcast. Bob with bitch tits. Yeah. We've oh talked about God. it twice now. We've struck. Oh. Y'all fucked up. It's always coming back to Fight yeah. Club. It's like diesel juice. Bring them on. Freaking tight. So, I, so bees. Yeah. And yeah. apparently he's going all the way. Yeah. I don't know what that means. H. <laughs> Because I mean, for huge, I don't know. Yeah, I no. I'm happy with my decision. I ain't walking around with chesticles. Yeah, I had that for long enough. I think. Yes. Yeah. So giant tits, just G- huge, huge, the bigger the better. Jeff, what's Got your it. question? I'm so concerned right now. Uh, you, should you should be. be. Yes, you those missing. I'm going to have such a great fucking vacation in jail. I can't follow it up with this question. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, no. Follow it the fuck up. Please. All no. right. So many questions. <laughs> Would you rather kill 25 kittens in a row or one dog? 25 oh. kittens. <laughs> oh. I can't. I can't. Put them all in a box and I I'll run it over. Hang on. I don't want either. <laughs> If it's life or death situation. Life or death, bro. But why is it life or death? It I don't know, man. Maybe because the kittens that. are radioactive. <laughs> so <laughs> let right. loose. If you're going to add caveats. Wait, yeah. 25 to 1. One I don't. No. One dog. I do not. Oh. I'm not killing a dog. To do either. Not killing a dog. But not is it Cujo? But it's if it's Cujo, the kitties one. live. Okay? I don't know. Yeah. Coming that, from like I don't like that question. I can't answer. I don't it. like this question. I can't, I can't do it. You it's, fucking picked it. I, don't I like know. It. You picked it. Sorry, man. So I'm answer it. It's in the fucking. Box. I don't want any animals to get hurt. But if it's did you pre-read? It's in the box. Yeah, I didn't. I don't like I it. Mean, you, you fucking picked it. Be mad What's at someone box? who put it in the box. I don't. I do not want to hurt. Either that fucks me up. I don't want to hurt either. Can't do it. Okay. What do you got? Mm. Would you watch a porn with the hottest girl from your high school 
if the dude of the porn was your dad. Oh, no. Oh, fuck no. Hold on. So she's no. in it and dad's do- Nope. No. 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 That's I love my dad. I don't want to see my dad naked. No. My dad wasn't around. No. I don't know. <laughs> no. <laughs> He's not in it. My dad's no. not in it. Uh-uh. No. 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 Good for him. Mm. I'm not watching it. No. Mm-mm. John? I feel like you you're pulled conflicted it. He's, on I, I'm a little conflicted. I feel uh, like you have uh, a boner. Uh, 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 no boner. Like a half chub. <laughs> no boner, and I'm but I'm trying to I'm trying to go back to high school to so, think who the hottest chick okay, was. So I feel like I don't even give a flying has fuck. Fine. No, what? I don't. That's what I'm trying to think oh, of who it would be. Yeah. I don't care. Hottest dude, hottest shit. Like I don't, I don't. Nope. My either way, because I went to high dad. school the chick that was in Playboy. But oh, she was the hottest either chick. way, my dad is involved. Yeah, she yeah. wasn't Ooh. even the hottest chick though. No, she school. wasn't. Not, like not even close. Like no. she was like maybe top. She was solid. 10, but yeah, she wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> Mm, either way oh, man i feel really nope. bad just nope. judging people it's not <laughs> judging it's just nope. i mean it's it's if you're preference. going off if you're going off you know what about what they look like physically now and she's still solid yeah she's still solid either way my dad's still involved in this so absolutely the I, fuck. I, I, i'm not gonna i'm not gonna lie i think your know. dad in a porn would be the uh, grossest no, thing I've ever no, seen in my life no, <laughs> no, I, don't I, I, I don't i would i would rather it. watch those plaque Scrapings uh, on YouTube where they're scraping the, te- the teeth. No. <laughs> I w- I w- but I feel like, like, is it because, like, oh, I feel like maybe because you're. St- <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't even know how to compare this. Kayla, are you, are you worried your dick looks like your dad's dick? <laughs> Kayla, you can no, say mine no. looks better. What? Is what? it prettier? <laughs> I hope so. Jesus Christ. Kayla's dick's got a chin. <laughs> No, like, who wants to see their dad in a porn? Oh, it's disturbing. It it is disturbing. I'm out. It's one of those ones where it's, if the guy is that obsessed with the girl from high school, he'll watch her do anything. Okay, that's fair, but I don't got Yeah, I uh, I didn't have that either. No. Maybe in high school. Really? But, like, now... You would have watched the what? hottest girl while Ooh, you were in man. high school. Who? But I'm just thinking about no. nobody could earn that title. To you would be have watched the watch hottest girl dad. while you were no. in high school, the girl that you thought was the hottest. You would have watched her in a porn with your fucking dad. That is disgusting. I just wanted to see my dad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. What a setup. <laughs> What a setup that was that was <laughs> good setup. Pumps well spike. played, that was buddy. <laughs> good job, buddy. That was volleyball. way to take that hey, self-deprecating Dad. humor and there just give it to us all. Yeah. But also, but also, as everybody feels really bad, it yeah. wouldn't have mattered if he knew his dad. He was there. He, he still would have watched it. I don't think he would. <laughs> Look at him. He's I'm not like, watching. Mm, yeah. Okay. Oh, watching. wait. No, Ooh. I am. <laughs> Are we just burning through? Are we going yeah, to the yeah, next sure, one? Yeah, sure, why not? All right. Gives us topics Lord. to talk about. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> what you... <laughs> you chose this. BJ, Remember, you're you the one who picked it. this, so you're looking <laughs> at yourself. Yeah, they're all fucking I mad just, at me. I came out of the box. I picked three, and I didn't put any back. <laughs> all right, would you rather live for the rest of your life with the sensation right before you sneeze... <laughs> Shit or come. Wait, what? I feel like that's all the same. <laughs> Would I rather? Is it not? The, it's just the constant. Would you rather live for the rest of your life with the <sighs> sensation right before you sneeze, shit or come? Wait, oh, like which one? Just live. I don't understand which... this question. I feel like sneeze. Read that. It's just saying, would you, would you would you rather live the rest of your life with the sensation right before you sneeze, shit, or come? So your choice is, would you rather feel like oh. a sneeze is coming, a shit is coming, or come is coming? <laughs> I feel like I'd rather live with the feeling like I was going to sneeze. No, I, I, I don't like the feeling. Come. Feel like you're gonna come every time. So you're walking in and blowing <laughs> up, blowing up that balloon until it explodes. Yeah, I'll be on that show. It just ha <laughs> ha. I can't. Sneezing drives me nuts. I hate it. And oh, feeling like that bubble gut, like you're gonna I hit shit the enough shit. as it is. I don't need more of it. So. It's just the feeling, though. It's not the actual. That's act. awful. 
Because no, everyone's was like, is this real? Is it not? Like, what is it going to happen? Is it no, not? for sure, it's going to be come. I'm just yeah, going to come. Come it's come. It's come. It's, come. it's always come. Sneeze. Kayla? You're I going sneeze. For sneeze. Sneeze? Wow. Well, if Jeff ever. No, never mind. We won't go there. <laughs> oh. I'm here for sneeze. Oh, no, no. Oh. Wait, now it's my turn? Yes. Yeah, Zinger. All right. <laughs> Throwing them out. <laughs> oh. I'm just going to come in with a. All right. None Would you shots. rather get stuck at a red light every time for the rest of your life? I'm out. Or become a loaf of bread for 24 hours once a year? Yeah, loaf of bread. Loaf of bread. Loaf Fuck of red bread. lights. Give me, it's only every one day. fucking red light for the rest of my <laughs> life? Yeah, I'm going to go with the bread. <laughs> it's <laughs> one day. It's 24 hours. One bread. day. For 24 this? hours. Like, are people yeah. eating me? I don't so really care. I'm just if they're not gonna, a, Is that like, what about cabinet. Bob, you know? Or, no, uh, Groundhog Day. I'm going to get a good night's yeah. sleep. We're like, it's terrible, but then you wake up and it resets. Somebody's going to eat you, yeah. and then uh-huh. there's no more life. So can I be like a well? Maybe they'll eat the end. Maybe they'll eat, eat my ass. ass. Eat my. <laughs> Nobody eats the ass of the bread. Nobody, Nobody eats. Nobody. Nobody eats the ass end of the bread. I do. Someone does. I make yes, sandwiches. Yeah. I make sandwiches out of it. Yeah. So it's maybe I'll eat that dog cabinet. Bun. And maybe oh, you fold that thing. You're hoping to eat the middle part. Bun. Someone's gonna eat my ass in that cabinet. That's wow. So gross. What do you so think? it's a way for the dream to come. There is so much, or, or I'm getting red lights. Mm. There's no, so much about Pretty my easy husband decision now that for me. I, you're learning. I am learning. You've yeah. been together for almost 12 years now, and you're uh-huh. learning okay, more. Okay, I'm gonna learn a lot get my tonight. Ass eat, or I'm gonna be stuck at a red light. I mean, oh is it even God. a decision? What are we even talking about? What did He's you just say? He's sucking all the dicks How for a thousand dollars. Wow! With he giant wants tits. his ass eat <laughs> with, with giant tits. tits. Yes. Oh yeah, he went full bore. Yeah, you're full like tits. the opposite of. All- He's, he's what gonna, are we talking about? He's gonna I suck. I mean, I guess suck bread. dicks oh. with giant tits for thousand dollars. And, and then I'm gonna get my eating. fucking asshole eaten out of a bread basket. I I'm don't know. So I'm like, I don't, I don't, what are you even talking about? <laughs> His face. I'm sorry, I don't know. BJ. That's how I feel. That is exactly how I feel. Your face. Sorry. That's how I feel. So Kay- not the Kayla- podcast BJ signed up for, but Kay- so I Kayla- didn't sign up get. for this either. So Kayla obviously is hey everybody uh, is stopping at every red light. Oh yeah. You yeah. don't want to be a loaf of bread? For one night, 24 hours. I don't hours. my ass eaten. No, no I'm not talking not about really your ass, ass eating. You're just going to take a bread. nice nap in a fucking pantry. Here's the loaf of bread. It didn't say whose pantry I was in. It's yeah. Diddy's pantry. Oh, oh well, we're all full. Oh, 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 no. eh, eh, eh. Can't stop. Don't stop. Oh, no. Take that. Take that. Yeah, no. Nah. Mm-hmm. Not right. in Diddy's pantry. Speaking of take that. Would you rather only hear one song for the rest of your life or only watch one TV show slash movie? Mm. One song. So one song. Well, show, I feel like you get more of a range, Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. I mean, you could choose a show that has like fucking 20 seasons. Sopranos? Yeah. Yes. I'm going with the show. But I love music. But it's only one song. I know, but you can't you can't have a variety. So there's music in the show. So you're getting yeah, that's a good point. Touche. So show. Maybe they maybe they maybe maybe they, maybe they pull the music the out of the same show. Got, you know, oh, yeah, yeah, but yeah. you can still I listen to as much that. music as you want, as long as you if you but you only can watch that one TV show. That's fine. Hmm. Yeah, I would sh- take that show. Show. Yeah, give me the TV show. I agree on that one. Yep. I was thinking movie, but I'm like, how many times can I watch basketball? I'm up to like 2,347, but who's counting? <laughs> yeah. Not you. Not at all. <laughs> I would love if that's really how many times you've watched it. <laughs> probably is. Don't no, question it, BJ. It probably no. is. When in high school, I watched Friday. Oh. Damn near every night before bed. That's a great movie. I watched Snatch. Watch a lot. Uh, Snatch. That movie's wonderful. Snatch every night Yo. before bed. <laughs> <laughs> for That's years. That's a great movie. <laughs> Snatch is a very good movie. Do you know... Have you watched it, Gentlemen? On I Netflix? Not. I have not. I haven't either. Okay. And I love Guy Ritchie's style. Like, I that do guy, too. And I love the movie, The Gentleman. Yeah. Eh. 
Eh. Did you? I, I like eh. that. Eh. That, eh. that Guy Ritchie movie that we just watched. Which one? Aladdin? With, no, with with uh, <laughs> Jason Statham. Guy Ritchie did the Aladdin. Are you shitting me? Yeah, I with not, Will Smith. Did not know that. <laughs> How did the one uh, that Dad told us to watch? <laughs> Which one? The movie with Dad. Who's Dad? Dad. Your dad? Dad. Fucking. Yeah. Where's my dad? Dad. Monarchs. Air Monarchs. Okay. Daddy. Dad. I call him Daddy. Wow. No, that was Dad. The movie he told us to watch where he was like, it blew my mind at the end. Yeah. Jason. Is that a Guy Ritchie movie? That's a Guy Ritchie movie. Yeah. But, it wasn't uh, very what good. What was that called? <sighs> I don't remember. <laughs> the Beekeeper? No, no. no, no. I, just, I just watched The Beekeeper. No, it was with Jason Statham. Um, I can't think of who else was in it. All right. I don't know. But it was a Guy Ritchie movie. It was... All right, but now you're, gonna watch, now you're going to watch Kay. Aladdin and be like, oh. Wait, whose turn is it? I feel like we depart. skipped Jeff on that last question. Did you? No, I got. Jeff's got one more. I got one more. Two more. I got two more. I have yeah. one Good. more. Good, I'm out. All right. Yeah? Really? You going to oh, find that fucking boy. movie? Yeah, that's what I'm looking at right now. Are you going? Would you rather there not be allowed to eat or not be allowed to drink while watching sports? Eat. Really? Yeah, I got to drown my sorrow some way watching the fucking bears. Uh, <laughs> I don't I even watch sports, good. so eat. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. It's definitely eat. Eat. Eat, really? I don't okay. really watch sports. So. I feel like I need to eat. Revolver. I'd rather really? eat than drink. Revolver. Revolver. I don't know. I'd one. rather have From It, was, it drink came out then. right before Rock and Roller. Huh. I love Rock and Roller. Okay. Got mixed reviews. I love it. Fair. Lock, stock, and two smoking right, barrels. So that movie's great. Great. Snatch. Snatch. Great. Never saw Swept Away. I like Rock and Roller. Just watched Revolver. Nah. Rock and Roller was good. Okay. Sherlock Holmes. Those are great. Those are good. He did the man, both, the, he? Yeah. The Man from Uncle. Oh, that's... Uh, the remake of that with, TV show. Yeah, yeah with um, Superman. Superman yeah, Superman. The guy who's now in a lot of trouble. Um, uh, King Arthur, The Legend of the who? Sword. I'm upset. You know what? I'm upset. Why are you upset? I love The Witcher. But oh. I will not watch oh. The Witcher anymore because... Henry's gone. He's gone. You know why he's gone? Because yes. he loves comic books. And he's obsessed. And they're going and he, off the They're going off the story. story and he was yeah. like, I'm done. He's, so guess what? He's hardcore, man. He's dedicated. And I'm now done. Thor's brother, Chris Hemsworth's brother... Is taking the role, and that guy. I feel bad. He's gonna. I Liam's hope he taking does, the role. Yeah, I hope he does good. But like, man, how do I'm you not gonna watch saying. it. How do you? Nope. I'm not gonna follow watch it. up. Nope. It was so good. Remember when I was telling you about the uh, remake of uh, the song by Mary J. Blige that was from the TV show you liked? The Umbrella Academy was yeah. the show. I couldn't think of the name of the show, and I just remembered it. It was the Umbrella Academy. That show is fucking Such a good show. Do you know who notch. wrote that? The guy from um, <sighs> Rock Band fucking. Yeah, uh, My Chemical Romance. Yes. yes. Joe Rogan's cousin. Yeah. I did not know that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, wow, that, really? Yeah. Fuck. They're like third cousins or something. <laughs> oh, okay. They're not cousins, well, son. Yeah. Stre- they just stretch it it's, out a It's like bit. aunt aunt's. His aunt is, or his, that show is his aunt's aunt. Awesome. Like yeah, he wrote the comic book, and then they approached and said, "We want to make this in a show." That's awesome. That show is wild. Dude. That's some shit. I love that show. And the Umbrella Academy and the boys are like my shit. See, I cannot. I haven't watched the boys. I can't what? get into it. I haven't. Oh, I haven't. No. Issue. Oh, it's have so you watched good. Brightburn? No. I've you have to. Really the boys is so good. Intense. I like a dark take. So I don't mind a dark. I love Zack Snyder. I don't mind a dark take on stuff. It's not that dark take. It's dark, dark take. So that's the thing. When Like when, if Superman was an egotistical cunt. Oh, see, I just. That is. Oh, that breaks my heart. It, but that's. But it's so Honestly, good. that's probably what it would be. I don't like it. It's so good. I don't. <laughs> I just have such this like special fucking nostalgic hold right. on 
Like, I'll take an anti-hero all day, but a, a sick, twisted, I'm going to be this in the light, and I'm going to be nasty as hell in the back line. Like, like I can't do yeah. that. But I he feel like as a destroyed. realist, like I want to see them all get destroyed. That is what it would. Be. So it's so no. it's it's you don't like the joke from Family Guy with <laughs> Superman when he's in hell. Stop! Stop! And, and they ask Superman, fa- Superman, why are you in hell? He goes, uh, Hooker made a crack about me being faster than a speedy bullet, so I I ripped her in half. <laughs> That's on Family Guy. Yeah. <laughs> the fact you remember that so well. Because that line is hilarious. Excuse me. Giggity, giggity, giggity. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. All right. All right, it's hang on. I'm reading one last thing, is. and then I'm getting the fuck Go. off of here because yeah. I have to pretend to be the Easter Bunny. Oh, yeah, it is. Happy yeah, Easter, everybody. Oh. Yeah, so. Happy Easter. Yeah. I gotta go to one brunch in like one three parent's got to do it. <laughs> wow. I'm going to have a basket later. If every time. Uh, it's what? All right. I don't even know what that means. If I, I don't even. <laughs> no one knows what But I feel means. like he meant it sexually and it doesn't make sense. All right. So if every time you got a boner, the same song would start playing, what song would you Ooh. want? Ooh. I know. Can I answer this, please? <laughs> yes. So. <laughs> What's I feel your like boner you song, about this. Dude, I have. I don't know why this has come up. I have 100% what thought about this boner song? for years. Do you remember Power Rangers? Do don't you remember when, when, when? No, not that song. Okay. <laughs> when the Green Ranger did his whistle, the flute. <laughs> <laughs> boo, 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 boo. All day. That's it. <laughs> that's your boner song. Yeah, that's my boner song. <laughs> so if you're watching, you're wa- walking by BJ, and also you hear. Do, 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 do. Calm down, get out buddy. Out of the way. Just get out. Calm of the down, way. buddy. Yeah. Wrong time. Wrong like time. Now I want to hear. Ooh. There's worse choices. So. There are. There are I'm worse sure. choices. I think we've we've answered this one before. <laughs> what was yours? Uh, I I think it was like the Rocky theme or something. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was the Rocky theme or something. <laughs> or it might have been. Hey what now, you're an all star. This game, huh? <laughs> I, I think that was another bar. one. Would you yeah. rather come every time All Star yes. by Smash Mouth came? Oh my god! I want to know your boner song. My boner oh. song? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that's the boner song. <laughs> Jeopardy <laughs> theme. Fuck! How the fuck are we gonna top that? We can't top that. No, that's pretty. I think that's, that's a good stopping good. point. Oh, I got more. Oh no! You got you got one more. I got one more. All right. <laughs> Would you rather fuck a chick that's banged a thousand dudes? Oh no! Or a chick who's banged one animal? One what? Animal? Is that what you just said? He yeah, give me the thousand dude banger because if this chick fucked a horse, I oh, I gonna do no. it. What kind of animal are we talking? About? Probably a sheep. <laughs> it's probably a sheep. What? She's bad. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> She's <sighs> so bad. We've derailed. <laughs> Yes, yeah, it's, it's so it. Bad. Well, we'll BJ, you it's sent over. me thirteen beers. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you get. <laughs> Fucking A, folks. Oh, no. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's over after that it's one. Over. It's over. It's so oh, bad. Good. It's bad. 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 Yeah, man. bad. <laughs> <laughs> for Jeff, for Kayla, for BJ, thanks for coming on the show, buddy. Thanks for having <laughs> Don't ever plan on releasing anything ever again because you're on a blacklist now. I am Sean. Come back next week oh my God. to another fun-filled episode of The Gentleman's Den. No, it's yeah. The Gender's Den. The Gender Den. Wow. <laughs> that just happened.